Blue Room is an arts programme for adults with learning disabilities. Blue Room is based in Liverpool at the Blue Coat, the UK's oldest art centre. Our members create artwork inspired by the art in our gallery. Well, what I like about coming to the Blue Coat, it's in the city centre and when I come in, I'm meeting people. It makes you feel important because it's uh, very well known, you know, and it, it gets mentioned and it makes me feel proud. What do Blue Room do at the Blue Coat? We look at different artists' work and then when we've looked at the, at, at the work, we come back and Becky says, um, which one did you like the most out of the gallery? And you've got to say about that. And then at the end, you could do something around her work. Blue Room learn about lots of different ways of making art. Painting. Draw them on the canvas and then paint them then. Drawing. I like drawing faces the best. Sculpture. Well, I like things that stand out like 3D. Printmaking. I love printing. Draw that. I'm printing all out. Photography. I like photography because it makes you feel good taking those caps outside. Performance. I like the boy. I like acting out. It made me be happy. Animation. I like making animations. I make things what, 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 what move. Being a member of Blue Room is a great way to meet lots of people and make new friends. I've got lots of friends and I mix very easily with people. I just get on so well with Blue Coat. I've got lots, lots of friends on the field goes and they make friends with me as well. It's like, like a happy family all together upstairs. Oh, oh it's lovely. And, and, and you're getting to meet people. Blue Room is funded by personal budgets. But how do Blue Room members access their personal budgets? Philip goes to meet his social worker. Come in. Hello. And I get me to go to Blue Room. Let me just check. That should be fine. Yeah. The council helps Philip to pay for Blue Room from his personal budget. They put the money into his bank account every four weeks. Philip tells his bank to pay the money to the Blue Coat. All our members make these direct payments, which together pay for Blue Room. How do Blue Room members get to the Blue Coat? And the travel independent on the bus. Some woman, Jill, came to my house and trained me first for a few weeks, and then she stepped back, then, and then I do it myself. And I got the independence on my own. It's good. I, I go by bus, 82 bus stop, bus stop, then back. I go by an independent woman, I do things by myself. Some people don't, I do. Get a taxi to a blue room with my friends. Richie pictures. Pictures of. I enjoy getting the taxi. Being part of Blue Room has opened up exciting opportunities for our members. Some Blue Room members have shared their skills with others. I helped them on a Tuesday with their artwork. If they can't do it, I help them. Make me feel proud, being an artist, yeah. Blue Room members exhibit their artwork at the Blue Coat. Taking part has helped Blue Room members to build confidence and become more independent. 
to lock my people and um, not being shy at all and getting on with people downstairs as well and upstairs. Because I used to miss out on things. It's like achieving your goal, isn't it? I'd just say, if anyone's got learning difficulties, don't sit in the house, look at the four walls, contact the Blue Rooms. If you or someone you know would be interested in joining Blue Room, please contact the Blue Coat on 0151 702 5324 or email info at thebluecoat.org.uk.